in the state of Florida who you've probably never heard of. Good evening, everyone. I'm Laura Harris. And I'm Paul Legrone. We're talking about this man, Richard Corcoran. He's from the Tampa Bay area, and he's making big headlines in Tallahassee. Today, I sat down with the new Speaker of the House for a one-on-one -on -one exclusive interview. He's about to have a major impact on how your money is being spent. From Tallahassee... These are all of them are really just personal notes. ...to Tampa Bay. We want to cut um, a tremendous amount of waste in government. Florida's new Speaker of the House... Does Florida have a spending problem? Absolutely has a spending problem. ...is changing the game. When we get done with the two years that our class and our legislature uh, left things significantly different. Richard Corcoran is coming off a historic trip to Tallahassee. He just passed record reforms within the state government, declaring war on lobbyists and setting into motion a revolution in how business gets done from now on in the state capitol. It's a disgraceful system. Corcoran established new rules for lawmakers, including a texting ban with lobbyists while they're on the floor. You can't have budget items get into the budget that are written on the back of a beer napkin and just an amount and say, hey, stick this in the budget. Now you have to own it. You have to put your name on it and file a bill and answer 37 detailed questions on what that project does. It sounds like you're trying to change a culture of corruption in Tallahassee. I, I would phrase it this way. It's recognizing truth. And the truth is this is that man left to their own devices um, will look out for their own interest over the, the interest of others. It's a war that's put him at direct odds with some members of his own party. It's really, really hard in those moments. They're very comparable when you know you're going to create um, enemies and, and people are going to dislike you and people are going to dislike you that are in your own family. But for this father of three who grew up in Pasco County, the battle scars are worth it. Standing up in that moment and fighting for it, regardless of the consequences, consequences, even when people say, well, he just wouldn't compromise, that's not bad, that's statesmanship. And tonight, Speaker Corcoran also wants to stop local governments from spending your tax dollars hiring professional lobbyists to advise state lawmakers. He says local leaders should be doing that job themselves.